Assalamualaikum warahmatullahi wabarakatuh. First of all, let's say, let's say thanks to Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala for giving us mercy for our whole life. Secondly, let's say thanks to our Prophet Muhammad sallallahu alaihi wasallam that has bring us from the darkness era to the enlightenment era, namely the Islamic era. The fall of Constantinople, also known as the conquest of Constantinople, was the capture of the capital of the Byzantine Empire by the Ottoman Empire. The city fell on 29, 20, 29 May 1453 as part of the culmination of, of, a, of a 53-day siege that had begun on 6 April. The city collapsed marks March, March end of the Middle Age. The attacking Ottoman army, which significantly outnumbered Constantinople and Thunder, was commanded by 21-year-old Sultan Mehmed II while Emperor Constantine XI led the Byzantine army after conquering the city. Magna II made Constantinople the new Ottoman capital, replacing Adrianople. The conquest, of the, con the, con the conquest of Constantinople and the fall of the Byzantine army was a watershed at the late Middle, uh, at the late middle Age, marking the effective of the, late, of, the last of the last remain of the Roman Empire. The state began in roughly 27 BC and lasted nearly 1,500 years. Among many modern historians, the fall of Constantinople is considered the end of the medi medi medieval period. The city, the city fall also stood as a turning point in military history. Since ancient times, towns and castles had, had depended upon, upon ramparts and walls to repel invaders. The wall of Constantinople, especially the Theodosian Wall, were some of the most advanced defensive system in the world at the time. These fortifications were overcome with gunpowder, gun especially large cannon bombers heralding a charge in siege warfare. Constantinople had been an imperial capital since conservation in 303. 330 under the Roman Emperor Constantine the Great. In the following 11th century, the city was besieged many times but was captured only once before. The sack of Constantinople during the Fourth Crusade in 1204, the Crusade established an unstable Latin state in, around Constantinople, while the remain, re, remainder of the Byzantine Empire splintered into several successor states, notably Nicaea, Epirus, Trebizond. They fought as allies against the Latin establishment, but also fought among themselves for the Byzantine throne. The Islamic prophet Muhammad once said, One day Constantinople will be con conquered. Great is the commander who will destroy it. Great are his soldiers. Although this hadith had been debated by a scholar as weak, the Nicene eventually reconquered Constantinople from the Latin in 1261, reestablishing the Byzantine Empire under the Palad dynasty. After that, where was little peace for the much weakened empire as it fended off successive attack by the Latin Serb, Bulgarian, and Ottoman Turks. Between 1346 and 1349, the Black Death killed almost half of the inhabitants of Constantinople. The empire general, economic, and territorial decline further depopulated the city. By 1453, a consider of a serial of walled village separated vast, by vast belt, encircled by the 5th century Theodosian wall. By, 15, by, by 1450, the empire was exhausted and had shrunk into a few square kilometers outside the city of Constantinople itself. The Prince Island of, in the Sea of Marmara and the Pel Peloponnesus, which is cultural center of Maestra, the empire of Trebizon an independent successor state that formed in the aftermath in the Fourth Crusade was also present at the time on the coast of the Black Sea. Thank you everyone for your attention. That's all for my speech. Assalamualaikum warahmatullahi wabarakatuh.